this isn't the job for me, and these aren't the shoes that I want. As a single mother of two, Carrie Ledbetter was wearing steel toe shoes, working grueling hours at a factory to get by until one day she had enough. She decided to go to college. I'm the first one in my family to go to college, first generation um, to graduate. So I had no idea what to do. Ledbetter went to the Single Parent Scholarship Fund of Benton County, who showed her the way to graduation. I love, love, love their slogan. It's like, it's, it's a hand up, it's not a handout. And I really love that, and they really carry that tone throughout the program. Instead of giving a lump of cash, Single Parent Scholarship holds students accountable. You have to fill out a form, submit it with your copy of your bill, and then they'll pay it. Um, like car, car insurance, light bill, things like that. Things that are just really helpful that you just don't have to think about extra while you're working overtime and <laughs> being a mom. <laughs> After six years working full time, taking care of her two kids, she graduated from NWAC and JBU and is now working for the Walton Family Foundation, setting an example for her children. She always used to sit on a couch and do her work get her notepad and get her computer and work. Nia is now following in her mother's footsteps. I think college is important because people, if people go to college, they can get more degrees and they can get better jobs and, and they can have a better life. Except Nia wants to be a vet and her son Anton says his mother is a great role model. She wants to prove that she's capable of taking care of us. And has taught him to work hard and finish school. Very important so you can get a job and get money. Ledbetter will be the keynote speaker for the upcoming Single Parent Scholarship Fund at Benton County's Corporate Luncheon. Just visit our website if you're interested in attending. UNLE 4029 News. And coming up tomorrow, we'll tell you how you can get a scholarship from the Single Parent Scholarship Fund of Benton County.